We know that between a quarter and a half of the population in the UK have persistent pain. It cuts across all age groups and the impact is massive. Pain's got a really useful function for us and it's helped us survive as we've evolved. It's a warning system for us and we rely on it being calibrated correctly. But we know with persistent pain that the calibration of that alarm system can change. We know there's a really strong emerging evidence base for the treatment of what's called primary pain, and this is pain where the nervous system has lost its way in its calibration. And when we can understand the things that underpin pain, we can then choose the best ways of managing it. And generally speaking, medication doesn't get to the root of pain, it kind of masks it. So the kind of things that we talk about in a pain service are looking at the root of pain. Everything matters when it comes down to pain because it's generally about how we can be as close to the best version of ourselves that we want to be. And in doing so, we can maybe improve how we eat, we can improve our sleep, we can improve our thoughts around things. And collectively, all of those things can turn us into a positive cycle where our nervous system starts to ground itself a bit better and recalibrate. Even when pain's been there a very long time, we're talking about how we help people recalibrate their alarm system within the nervous system. And that's what a pain service should be doing, it's helping them be the best version of themselves they want to be.